Listen and practice. Going to school. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Lily who was very excited to go to school. She had heard so many wonderful stories about school from her older siblings and friends. She couldn't wait to learn new things, make new friends, and have fun adventures. On Lily's first day of school, she woke up early and got dressed in her new uniform. She ate a big breakfast and then her mother helped her pack her backpack with all the things she needed, like her lunchbox, her water bottle, and her crayons. When they arrived at school, Lily was amazed by how big and colorful it was. There were children running around everywhere, laughing and playing. Lily felt a little bit nervous, but she was also very excited. Lily's teacher, Ms. Smith, was a kind and welcoming woman. She showed Lily to her seat and introduced her to the other children in the class. Lily quickly made friends with a girl named Sarah. They sat together at lunch and played together at recess. Lily loved school. She loved learning new things and making new friends. She especially loved reading and math. Lily was a very bright student and she excelled in her studies. One day, Lily's class was learning about the solar system. Lily was fascinated by the planets and the stars. She asked Ms. Smith so many questions that Ms. Smith had to tell her to slow down. At the end of the year, Lily's class had a science fair. Lily decided to make a model of the solar system. She worked very hard on her project and she was very proud of the results. On the day of the science fair, Lily was nervous, but she was also excited to show everyone her project. The judges were very impressed with Lily's model and she won first prize. Lily was so happy. She had a wonderful year at school and she couldn't wait to come back the next year. The End Repeat after me. Going to school. Going to school. Going to school. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Lily who was very excited to go to school. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Lily who was very excited to go to school. Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Lily who was very excited to go to school. She had heard so many wonderful stories about school from her older siblings and friends. She had heard so many wonderful stories about school from her older siblings and friends. She had heard so many wonderful stories about school from her older siblings and friends. She couldn't wait to learn new things, make new friends, and have fun adventures. She couldn't wait to learn new things, make new friends, and have fun adventures. She couldn't wait to learn new things, make new friends, and have fun adventures. On Lily's first day of school, she woke up early and got dressed in her new uniform. On Lily's first day of school, she woke up early and got dressed in her new uniform. On Lily's first day of school, she woke up early and got dressed in her new uniform. 
She ate a big breakfast and then her mother helped her pack her backpack with all the things she needed, like her lunchbox, her water bottle, and her crayons. She ate a big breakfast and then her mother helped her pack her backpack with all the things she needed, like her lunchbox, her water bottle, and her crayons. She ate a big breakfast and then her mother helped her pack her backpack with all the things she needed, like her lunchbox, her water bottle, and her crayons. When they arrived at school, Lily was amazed by how big and colorful it was. When they arrived at school, Lily was amazed by how big and colorful it was. When they arrived at school, Lily was amazed by how big and colorful it was. There were children running around everywhere, laughing and playing. There were children running around everywhere, laughing and playing. There were children running around everywhere, laughing and playing. Lily felt a little bit nervous, but she was also very excited. Lily felt a little bit nervous, but she was also very excited. Lily felt a little bit nervous, but she was also very excited. Lily's teacher, Ms. Smith, was a kind and welcoming woman. Lily's teacher, Ms. Smith, was a kind and welcoming woman. Lily's teacher, Ms. Smith, was a kind and welcoming woman. She showed Lily to her seat and introduced her to the other children in the class. She showed Lily to her seat and introduced her to the other children in the class. She showed Lily to her seat and introduced her to the other children in the class. Lily quickly made friends with a girl named Sarah. They sat together at lunch and played together at recess. Lily quickly made friends with a girl named Sarah. They sat together at lunch and played together at recess. Lily quickly made friends with a girl named Sarah. They sat together at lunch and played together at recess. Lily loved school. She loved learning new things and making new friends. Lily loved school. She loved learning new things and making new friends. Lily loved school. She loved learning new things and making new friends. She especially loved reading and math. Lily was a very bright student and she excelled in her studies. She especially loved reading and math. Lily was a very bright student and she excelled in her studies. She especially loved reading and math. Lily was a very bright student and she excelled in her studies. One day, Lily's class was learning about the solar system. One day, Lily's class was learning about the solar system. One day, Lily's class was learning about the solar system. Lily was fascinated by the planets and the stars. She asked Ms. Smith so many questions that Ms. Smith had to tell her to slow down. Lily was fascinated by the planets and the stars. She asked Ms. Smith so many questions that Ms. Smith had to tell her to slow down. 
Lily was fascinated by the planets and the stars. She asked Miss Smith so many questions that Miss Smith had to tell her to slow down. At the end of the year, Lily's class had a science fair. At the end of the year, Lily's class had a science fair. At the end of the year, Lily's class had a science fair. Lily decided to make a model of the solar system. She worked very hard on her project and she was very proud of the results. Lily decided to make a model of the solar system. She worked very hard on her project and she was very proud of the results. Lily decided to make a model of the solar system. She worked very hard on her project and she was very proud of the results. On the day of the science fair, Lily was nervous, but she was also excited to show everyone her project. On the day of the science fair, Lily was nervous, but she was also excited to show everyone her project. On the day of the science fair, Lily was nervous, but she was also excited to show everyone her project. The judges were very impressed with Lily's model and she won first prize. The judges were very impressed with Lily's model and she won first prize. The judges were very impressed with Lily's model and she won first prize. Lily was so happy. She had a wonderful year at school and she couldn't wait to come back the next year. Lily was so happy. She had a wonderful year at school and she couldn't wait to come back the next year. Lily was so happy. She had a wonderful year at school and she couldn't wait to come back the next year. The End Answer the question. 1. What was Lily most excited about for her first day of school? A. Learning new things. B. Making new friends. C. Having fun adventures. D. All of the above. Which teacher helped Lily on her first day of school? A. Ms. Brown B. Ms. Smith C. Ms. Jones D. Ms. Williams Three, what was Lily's favorite subject in school? A. Reading B. Math C. Science D. All of the above Four, what did Lily make for her science fair project? A, a volcano. B, a model of the solar system. C, a robot. D, a painting of a rainbow.
5. What prize did Lily win at the science fair? A. Second prize. B. Third prize. C. First prize. D. No prize.